Hello again folks, um, first of all apologies for the lack of videos over the last two to three weeks um, Unfortunately I've been extremely busy with work and some other stuff and I've simply not had the time to do any content for you um, So apologies for that, um, but now you know um, Now part and parcel have been extremely busy, I've not been checking my YouTube channel um, I did tonight and I know that I'm almost at one and a half thousand subscribers which is absolutely fantastic um, So tonight I thought I'd do a really quick sort of update video telling you why I've not been doing videos as I've just done uh, coupled with a little uh, competition time announcement um, which sounds very official Chris um, yeah announcement whatever you want to call it um, and also uh, show you something I'm going to be covering in future videos so without further ado let's go ahead and have a look so this is the crumble or crumble um, if you've never heard of it, and I know I certainly hadn't heard of it, um, essentially what it is is a little microcontroller or programmable microcontroller project board. Um, now, my daughter uh, got this from a school. Um, they were using it for a project and um, the class or whatever couldn't get it to work and the teacher basically said, take what you want, You know, we're just going to get rid of these. If you want to take anything home with you, uh, please do so. So my daughter grabbed it, asked me if I wanted it and um, yeah I thought I'd take a look at it and then share it with you um, and it's absolutely fantastic um, yeah it's a programmable uh, microcontroller um, it uses a microchip um, PIC 16F1455 um, and it is super simple uh, to use super simple to program it's just a great little introduction to uh, PIC programming um, now what I thought I'd do tonight, I'm not going to go too far uh, into detail with it, um, let's say I'm going to do some videos on it in the near future, um, but I thought I'll just hook it up uh, to little simple, um, uh, sorry, hook it up to some LEDs um, and show you how it works with this simple programming I've put on this. So what we're going to use is the... Um, I'm not going to say industry standard, but these very common uh, WS2812 uh, addressable uh, RGB LED modules, you can pick these up on eBay for uh, a couple of quid each, including delivery. Um, and it's it's quite, quite yeah, can't speak, get your teeth back in, Chris. It's really quite simple to uh, hook up. So we hook up the positive and negative to the positive negative on the right hand side of the USB port here. Uh, this one here, as you can see on the green wire, is the data. So I'm just going to hook this up to point D on the board <clears throat> there we have it and then simply attach 5 volts to the other side and it will kick into life now I may need to drop the exposure down the camera apologies for this if it gets a bit wobbly but there we have it um, really simple um, really simple sort of sequence solid red, solid green, and then a cycle through of various different colours. Um, now, this is all programmed using um, the uh, Crumble a software package. Let's see, you can download it for free from uh, redfernelectronics.co.uk. Um, and it's it's really simple. Um, it's drag and drop. Um, you, you simply drag in what you want each uh, element to do, the timings you want it to do, uh, if in this case what colour you want the LEDs to light up, so I want LED 4 to light up, you know, uh, violet, whatever you want to do, um, you click upload and it just works, it's really simple, um, it's, it, you know, to use layman's terms, it's like a really simplified version of an Arduino, um, aimed predominantly I think at the educational sector um, but you can as dual public go to redfernelectronics.co.uk and purchase one direct I think they cost you maybe about £10 including delivery somewhere uh, around that sort of figure um, but the really capable little uh, boards um, you, you know in terms of it for a I say capable um, they are a simple board um, but they do have MOSFETs on there so you can drive motors direct uh, from the board um, you've got um, options for analog and digital inputs uh, you can have a sort of analog output if you like um, and drive servos uh, as well so really little fun little board um, super simple to use super simple to program and it's something i think will be absolutely fantastic for somebody who's not had any involvement in pick programming before such as myself um, 
but yeah i'll be covering this in a couple of videos in the future i'll take you through how the package works uh, if i haven't already mentioned it's just drag and drop really super simple uh fantastic little uh, project board for getting the kids involved in electronics so there we have it guys, um, just a really quick video, really quick update, I know it's not a brilliant video, uh, but hopefully it gives you a little flavour of what's to come. Um, like I say, this is a competition time video, um, so how will we, uh, what will have you commenting on this one? Um, comment whatever you want this time, just say whatever you want on there, no swearing, it's a child friendly channel this hopefully, so no swearing but you can say whatever you want, uh, any comments, any suggestions, um, just type potato or something, I don't know, whatever you want to do, <laughs> just uh, put down there and uh, in a couple of days I will do a little prize draw, so uh, as it's quite short notice you'll probably get a good chance of winning if, uh, if you comment on it uh, this time. So, as always, I'm starting to ramble on. Um, thanks very much for uh, watching this video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. I hope you uh, found it interesting and are looking forward to these future videos on Crumble. Um, yeah, I can't say much more than that. If you enjoyed it, give me a thumbs up. If you didn't, give me the thumbs down. As always, if you haven't done so and you'd like to do so, please subscribe. Um, on my fat head here. <laughs> um, thanks for watching, guys. As always, take care of yourselves and all the best.